Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. As some of you will be aware that Makwas has embarked on an initiative during this blessed month of Ramadan to support people who are vulnerable, isolated and shielding, as well as refugees and asylum seekers. Um, due to this COVID pandemic, people are really, really struggling to make ends meet. So many people have lost, lost their jobs. Uh, people with no status living in the UK um, are really finding it hard to make ends meet. And what we thought was the least we can do to support them during this blessed month was to provide them with some essential food packs that will support them with their iftar and suhoor. So I'm just on the way to the local cash and carry to do a grocery shopping with a couple of the brothers there. So inshallah when I get there I'll be able to introduce you to them. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Farhan Giladar. I'm here helping um, helping us um, deliver uh, iftar packs back to the centre. Um, we're here at Westway Cash and Carry um, to help support all the families that are needy this Ramadan uh, for the iftar packs. Um, Jazakallah khair to everyone who, who donated uh, so that we're able to do this. It's been a fantastic effort by really? the community. I've got brother Farhan Ghalib here who has arrived at the Best Way Cash and Curry to help us with some grocery. Assalamu alaikum. Wa oh, alaikum assalam brother. I'm just, you know, a driver here. You know, Brother no. Mamoun is our Amir. No, no, so not He will <laughs> tell me what to pick up and what to put in the car and I will do as instructed, <laughs> inshallah. Bit early start of the day for me on Saturday. I'm not cycling today, so maybe this will be some exercise, inshallah. Jazakallah for coming and helping us. I've got the two Farhans with me. Farhan Ghalib and Farhan Kirida here. We have a new driver today, Mr. Zishan Ghalib. Assalamu alaikum. Alaikum assalam. How are you? Alhamdulillah. Are you going to help us today, yeah? Inshallah. Do you do 11? This is... No, it's uh, 9. Yeah, that's enough. Okay, that's enough. Okay, that's enough. Down on the marketing? Ah. Uh. Alhamdulillah, nice shop actually. We got most of the stuff we wanted and in the right size of packing. That's more important actually. That makes it easier to distribute and make even bags. Inshallah. So inshallah, inshallah we'll take it to the masjid now and I'll float it there and then come back later and make packs for the people and then distribute inshallah. Uh, Alhamdulillah, a lot of people are contributing and I'll ask some friends to come along and help us out in our floating. So inshallah, inshallah we'll get there. Yeah. Alhamdulillah, the shopping is now done and we're about to load the cars. Yeah. So Alhamdulillah, we've now loaded the car with all the stuff we bought today. Inshallah, we're going to the masjid to offload there. A couple of brothers will come to help us out, Inshallah. Very really hard work by Farhan Khalidal and Mahmoud here. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Imam Yusuf helping us, mashallah. <laughs> May Allah accept from us, Inshallah. Amin, amin. Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Afro. We've got a small charity called Asili Foundation. And uh, this Ramadan, alhamdulillah, we're partnering with Makwas. I'm regular in Makwas as well. And I've come to pray here, um, pray all my prayers here, alhamdulillah. We've gone into partnership in helping refugees, struggling families during Ramadan. And uh, it's been very good. Zakallah khair for every, to everyone for their donation. That's helped a lot of families and alhamdulillah, Many of us, you know, we've, we're having iftar every day, we have food on the table every day, but we've been working with lots of families who don't have even this luxury. So, partnering with Makwas, we've done so much, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah everyone, and keep supporting us, keep helping us in, in this good work, and may Allah bless everyone. MashaAllah, we've got a number of volunteers helping us with the grocery packs. <coughs> In the kitchen here, I've got Brother Asif and Imam Shahin. 
Yusuf Shahin. Assalamu alaikum. What's happening, Brother Asif? Alhamdulillah, we are arranging foods for uh, vulnerable and uh, poor and needy people, inshallah. We'll get this sorted and we'll deliver, inshallah. Inshallah. As you can see from the kitchen here, it's full, alhamdulillah. All this will be going to refugees and as asylum seeker families in Croydon, Sutton, Merton, as far as North London, West London as well. Um, we need more volunteers to come and help and support us to make the packs, inshallah. Use a tap, use a tap. The tap, the thing, just touch the tap. Come on. Mm. I think we have a bigger bag, maybe we can make. Don't worry about packing it, okay. Just grab it from the back. <laughs> One day before Ramadan starts and I'm just on the way to the masjid to meet Dr. Rabia Khan who is a volunteer at Care for Calais and she has been supporting refugees and asylum seekers over the past year especially during Covid to get essential food packs and essential items to these refugee centres and um, so far alhamdulillah we've managed to distribute nearly 100 food packs to various um, refugees, asylum seekers, vulnerable and isolated people and uh, I'll be able to hand over 25 packs to her so that can be delivered directly to those centres uh, before Ramadan starts. Okay, Asalaamu Alaikum, my name is Dr. Rabi Khan and I'm a volunteer with Care for Calais. Um, I've been volunteering with them since 2017 over in Calais and in Dunkirk and since last August 2020 we've had a number of refugees in the UK. We got a call out for some in Wimbledon and that was back in um, and it was the end of July and since then we've been helping support them. See, with the holy month of Ramadan coming upon us we are now um, in partnership with Mukwas who have kindly donated iftar bags in the local areas so we're providing for refugees in Wimbledon, in Croydon, in Red Hill, a number of them families, single parents, um, pay people with disabilities and it's been an enormous help so thank you very much. So now I'm in the kitchen of Mukwas and there's a lot of stuff here so I'm just going around and collecting all the various things that I'll actually be of use to them. Oil, very useful, and tuna, and olives. Ah, important, the most important thing, dates. <laughs> Hurry up, Mamir boy, hurry up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got between Nadir and Sheikh Asif is standing, and Nadir is saying, You're slow. Okay. MashaAllah, very hard working volunteers at work. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Hani Abdallah. Um, just been helping <laughs> break down boxes at the moment, but actually fill some, uh, some bags full of some lovely. Um, some lovely uh, goods. I'm very blessed, honoured um, to be able to, to provide my uh, time to, to doing this. Um, I think it's such a worthwhile cause, uh, especially during Ramadan, inshallah. Salaam alaikum. Thank you. 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 Ramadan Kareem to the brothers and sisters uh, we live local ourselves we're 10 minute drive um, and we felt that we need to reach out to our community um, as it's it's the most um, difficult time um, this is Allah's Qadr uh, we're being tested so um, it's only um, a, a, a very good opportunity for us to maximize during this difficult time um, and as well as um, in, in the month of Ramadan as well we we felt that it, it we, you know we, we could um, um, also 
um, engage in, in, in this beautiful opportunity um, on the blessed month of Ramadan. Assalamu alaikum, this is Idris. I'm a Seton resident. I'm a member of Makwas, also doing volunteering for Care for Calais. Uh, today we are delivering some food packs provided by Makwas to Care for Calais for a hotel, uh, for, for some residents staying in a hotel in Croydon. They are the as asylum seekers basically having almost nothing, only staying in a hotel and uh, just uh, getting the food provided by the other vol uh, voluntary organizations. Thank you very much for your contributions. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. I am Farhan Kilda. I'm here helping pack up all the packs that we've got for the Garden Fitter. This is all down to your donations over the past two weeks. Alhamdulillah, we reached our target of £2,000 and now we're delivering to various different families around the local community as asylum seekers, refugees, and other people in dire trouble that need our help. Um, these are all the packs that are going to um, to various different locations. Um, inshallah, jazakallah khair for all your efforts and all the donations that have come through to enable us to do this. Assalamu right. alaikum. My name is Nur Jahan Rabalia and I work locally with the community doing voluntary work. Uh, Alhamdulillah, this year with the help of Makwas that is uh, in Sutton, we managed. They've managed to raise money for Zakat al Fitr. And as you can see, they have, they have made par food parcels, which inshallah was given out to refugees uh, and some uh, uh, people uh, uh, in great need in this area and in several areas around Sutton and around here. Alhamdulillah that the work has gone very well and it has reached people who, who were definitely uh, in need of it. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept it and to reward everyone who contributed and also the message is to say that this, because this was from the Zikat al Fitra, make sure that the food reaches everyone before they eat Salah, because this is one of the conditions of uh, Zikat al Fitr. Inshallah, I hope you will support this again too for them next year. And we ask Allah to accept this. Jazakallah khairan. Alhamdulillah, we have arrived in Guildford to distribute uh, Zikat al Fitr grocery bags which is going to some refugees and asylum seekers uh, in the local area. I've got Brother Farhan here with me. And Brother, and Brother Philip here. Asalaamu Alaikum Brother Philip. Wa Alaikum Asalaam. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Okay. Thank you so much for you guys. Huh? You're most welcome. You're most welcome. 